Hey, welcome back to my channel. This is Kara, and we're playing some more Pokemon Violet on the Nintendo Switch, and I'm back with another episode. So it's been maybe months since I last played because I've just been so sidetracked. Um, well, with real life and with um, pretty much Genshin Impact and other things, so I haven't really been touching Pokemon. Um, so in the previous episode, we defeated Carmen, and we also cleared content. Um, we also defeated Perrin, um, so we're just going to move on with the storyline. Wormy was defeated, so we're just going to put away the soft sand and bench Wormy. So Wormy is sent to the Shadow Realm, we no longer need it. Um, we're going to uh, evolve Hydra into another Hydra Apple. So we're going to do that first. Uh, Ogre Pond, yeah, I feel like we need to level him up. Uh, we're going to use the Pokemon Center. So we're just going to heal up first. Right. Everybody has a Luxury Ball. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, we're going to be dealing with... First Luna. Which is going to be a completely powerful beast that we need to work out a way to defeat. Uh, I think for the time being, we should boost the level on um, Hydra. Right, I reckon dropping six on you will be fine. Right, level 75, we'll drop another six. Uh, yeah, we'll drop six on you. Right, I think we're good. Now, I know the pesky three are back at the locations where they are. I need to capture them. Although, I don't think they're important for this content, so I'm just going to ignore them. So first of all, we're just going to head over here, grab the apple to evolve Hydra, and then we'll head into the forest and do the Timeless Wood event with uh, Perrin. Okay, so we're at the location where we can buy the syrupy apple. Uh, I'm going to buy one. Actually, we'll buy another one. We'll, we'll keep one spare. Right, so we've got syrupy apple. Now, we're just going to use that apple to evolve um, Hydra. So we just need to find the apple. This apple. Right, Hydra's evolving. Alright, awesome. Double hit. Now, how do we evolve Hydra? Alright. Nope. Uh, let's check the summary. We need to give it some new moves. Okay, we're going to give it Energy Ball. Yeah, we're going to teach it Dragon Breath. All right. That's not bad. Um, I'm also going to give this to um, Ogre Pond. We're going to make it a water type. Oh. There we go. <laughs> okay, that, that caught me by surprise. Uh... We're going to give wife's glasses, since there's no real other items to give. Okay. Okay, I happen to find a flock of Bombardia. Since it is a... Uh, what's it we'll call it? I actually forgot the name of the region. <laughs> Paldean Pokemon. We're going to capture it. Never seen that move before. Okay. Hopefully we capture it. Okay, we, we, we're gonna hold back on the... Okay. Okay, super effective. That's annoying. We'll try... Pokeball. Okay. 
Okay. We arrived at the Timeless Woods. Um, unfortunately, Bombardier knocked itself out by using Dual Wind Beat. Uh, I recovered the rest of my party, so we're all good. We just used the healing items that we have. Although, maybe we may have wasted our healing items. Uh, let's keep watching her. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, let's keep watching. Should we call out to her? Let's call out to her. We've made it. Okay. Nice. Okay. Ariados. Oh yeah, she's afraid of bugs. Mm, better lend a hand. Here we go. All right, we're sending in more. Oh yeah, we get a growl up at the end of this. All right, let's use block slide. All right. That surprised her. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna set up camp. I'm gonna set up a tent, just like sword and shield. All right, looking good. It's a shaming tent. Originally, I thought it was camo, but no, they're shaming. Pretty decent tent. Right, I'm gonna look for the Blood Moon Beast. So it's pretty simple, we just have to go around and photograph 10 different Pokemon. And then, we face off against uh, Ursa Luna. We've already done this on uh, Pokemon Scarlet, so this should be a piece of cake. Although the battle will be difficult. Right. Ten species of Pokemon. All right. No riding on. Me ride on. All right, we're gonna turn me ride on into a Pokemon. Uh, let's get off him. Battle form. Let's go. Ah, oh, there's a. What's it we call it? Okay, so we completed the survey. We've taken 10 pictures just by running around looking for Pokemon. Now we're back with Perrin. So we should immediately encounter Ursa Luna. Oh man, I'm not... I have a bad feeling about Ursa Luna. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I think Growlithe spotted it. Uh-huh. Oh, I just smashed day. <laughs> That's not good. Now, where is Ursa Luna? You're in a bit of a slump? Uh-huh. Yeah, I guess. Mm -hmm. and the longer it keeps dragging on. Oh. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. We'll be okay. You'll be fine. Yep. There we go. Nice jingle.
All right. Let's meet it. All right. That's the loon. It should be coming up. I'm a little bit worried, but I reckon we can take it. Growlithe has been a little bit restless. Alright, that's a loon or should be coming up. Uh, don't let your guard down. Stay alert. Here we go. So, it's been here for hundreds of years since it washed up from uh, Shino region. Actually, I'm a little bit surprised that it came all the way from Hisui. Oh, uh, you just agitated it with a flash. Yep. Pokemon Legends theme. Oh, Galif doesn't want to fight. I got this covered. Right, trust in me. Right, we've got more. I'm going to start for yourself with a relatively easy spiky shield. But given that it is a poison type, I should be cautious. Right, spiky shield. Put it to the self. Earth power. Right, I don't think that did anything. Okay. Uh, we'll send in Ogapon. If Ogapon goes down, we'll just permanently bench it. If Miraidon goes down, we're going to keep permanently keep it off our bench and just use it as a ride. Right, Ivy Kugel. Nice. Should be fine. Blood Moon. Oh. Okay. I was not expecting that. Right. Uh. Oh man, what do we do? All right, we're gonna. Hmm. We're gonna try and be right on. Hydron Edgen. Right, uh Terra Blast. Hopefully this does damage. Terra Blast. Okay, that did something. Alright. Terra Blast. Oh, man. Blood wound. Okay. Okay, me right on down. Hmm. I'm a little bit worried. Caliburn's just gonna go down in one shot. Hydra has the type of advantage, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Okay, face of the rest has gone down. Uh 
Right, energy ball. Calm mind. That's concerning. Haha, <laughs> a special attack has gone up. Oh no. Okay, we didn't survive. That's concerning. We could suffer a wipeout here. Okay, Mora? Spiky shield. Set to the self. Earth power. Alright. Uh, rock slide. All oh, right, we might flinch it. It's not effective. Okay, we we lost more. Caliban. Man, Earth Luna is just decimating my team. Icicle crash. Okay. Calibur has a chance. Alright. Right. We knocked it down. <laughs> okay. Alright, we've got to capture it. I'm going to use the Luxury Ball. Oh man, it wiped out my entire team. Apart from Kiriko, Ursa Luna. Are we going to give it a, a name, a nickname? Um, probably not. I don't even know if I'm going to use it, to be honest. Yeah, I don't feel particularly... I, I did say we were just going to use Paldean Pokemon, so I guess we're not going to use as Luna. Well. Gowlif is just plain dead. He didn't do much. Right. Oh, we just got to get a free recovery. Right, packing up the old tent and calling it a day feels a bit sad. Yeah, I guess. Now what are we going to do? We we have essentially only po two Pokemon left. And again, I guess Mora wasn't really doing me much. Huh, well... Hmm, let's head back to town. Okay, we return back to Mosui Town. To speak with Perrin. Just to round off the episode, we just got to speak to her. Every, all my Pokemon are fully healed, but they did get die. They did get knocked out in that battle, so there's not a lot we can do. Oh. Oh. Uh, the picture wasn't that good. Oh, okay. She had fun. Oh, right. She got so caught up with the craftsmanship that she just lost all sense of fun and joy in her hobby. Alright, okay. Ah, you can call me Uni. Mm-hmm. And she's just got to take a lot of pictures of me. Oh, no. Choice Scarf. That's a pretty decent item, actually. Alright. And we got Growlithe. Alright. 
Off to go. I'll raise this Growlithe to be strong. Right, until we meet again. And that's that. Well, I guess we lost two... Two of our Pokemon, so... We're just gonna round off the episode by benching stuff. Oh, Growlithe is low level. Right, okay, wrong thing. Box. Right, I'm gonna officially call it. Ursa Luna, we didn't need name. It's not a Paldane Pokemon, so we're not gonna use it. Growlithe, we're gonna bench. There we go. We're down to two Pokemon and Nuzlocke. We're not gonna use Ursa Luna or Growlithe. Uh, Mora and Hydra are benched. Ogapon is permanently benched, and yeah, that's that. We're, we're going to end the episode here. hope you guys enjoyed the content so far. Remember to like and subscribe. And in the next one, we're going to be heading off to Blueberry Academy. So stick around. Hey, thank you for watching my video. I hope you guys all enjoyed that. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to like and subscribe and drop a comment in the comment section below and let me know what you think. It really does help me out. If you haven't already done so, you can also hit the bell icon and turn on notifications. That way you'll get updates for when I upload my new videos or follow me on Twitter at Kuroaki Games. I'm also on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Kuroaki Games where I occasionally stream my raw gameplay videos on there or some content that isn't on YouTube. You can also follow me on Instagram at Kuroaki Games and I will see you guys soon.